um, Filipinas were not date to sleep with. Like, we're not dating a person that um, dating like after that you will sleep with him. No. 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 So what is dating like for you? Like, kuan, um, knowing each other, uh, getting to know each oh, other. To that's know each the other. that's the important thing. Yeah. So what is the what the, what if a one guy will gonna say or let's say yeah one guy will gonna say um, let's have a dinner date tonight. I'm so happy that I found you here and welcome to my channel so hello good day everyone so this is a new day new vlog a new topics new story of a young Filipina and a beautiful Filipina <laughs> right. so um, so Jenna May what um, what do you do for a living um, I'm so working, work. and working. What is in your a work? printing shop Printing shop. Yeah. So printing services. Is it the salary is okay? Yeah. So is it can support your daily lives, yeah. daily needs? <laughs> All right. So where are you living right now? Tampi. Tampi. Is that far from here? How many hours? No, it's 45 minutes, I think. So what you brings here in Bolivar? <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry, lang just to have fun uh. with your brother and. Oh, they're so sweet. You know, you know what? She is sitting in the bench alone, <laughs> so she don't have partner. But her brother has a partner. <laughs> so, um, since you are 19 years old, um, what is your like? Have you been through college or no? No, I'm taking an exam. Exam. Yeah. Where's the inertia? I'm waiting. Yeah. Ah, I'm what, waiting what for course? the result. What course? BSIT. Wow, so not all. That's why you're working in the printing press right now. Yeah. All right, that's great, Joanna May. So Making designs. hopefully, hopefully they will call you. Yeah. So who are supporting your um, college soon? Who will be the one sending you money? My parents. Your parents. Yes. Um, but now I'm helping them. You're helping them as of now. But when you have class, they're the ones to help you. Yeah. Oh, that's great. <laughs> <laughs> so, as a Filipino, um, and when. Our parents will, um, when we born and grow up, our parents will be the one supporting our needs. And we finish our studies and we have work or job already. Um, is it our responsibility to pay them? To pay them back? Maybe, or depending lang jud ni mo nga anak. Yeah. It depends if you want to help. Mm -mm. But many Filipinos saying that. Um, as a yeah, as a Filipino children, or yeah, as a Filipino children, we need to uh, help. we um we need to help our parents. Yeah. We need to pay them back. Is that true, or it is about willingness? It's about your choice. Kaya na uban manggod choice. Bisag unsa? Na uban manggod nga bisag unsa pa kama ayus sa ginikanan is ilahara japon nga pasagdaan maybe. Yeah, even the parents are good to them. Yeah. They don't care. Because you know, um, many Filipinos saying that it is our responsibility to pay them back. But the truth is, if you are if you have a willingness, if you have a heart to help them, because you know what are the hardship of uh, have you been experienced in your life with your family. So it's your um, it's your choice to help them. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so since you are going to be in college soon so what is your plan are you excited yeah basun makapasar <laughs> hopefully you can pass the yeah. exam or hopefully they will call you but what if they will not call you they will not um say they will not gonna send you a message that oh kohan jenami you got the slot what if what you are gonna do i'll find a way to You'll find a way to go to school and <laughs> so hopefully, but yeah, we're hoping a lot that hopefully they will gonna call you and oh, you got the slot. But they will gonna start soon, maybe in August. The class will gonna start soon. I passed the entrance exam. Oh, that's great. But so, uh, interview. Yeah, done. 
you already done the interview. Yeah. So all you need to do is to so wait the for result. them to call you that you pass the interview. Yeah. When is the when was that? August 4, I think. August 4. Mm -hmm. I no, it's still July now. Um, August. or the result will be in be August. August uh. Ah, okay. okay. I thought what was that? When was the interview? <laughs> when was the interview held? 24? 24. Uh, July 24, oh, I was interviewed. Alright, that's nurse. great. Yeah. So, what is your future plan when you graduate? Maybe find a job. Find a job. Yeah. So, since you are working in a computer shop, when you go home, do you still doing the home chores? Yeah. Yeah. Like cooking? Um, cooking. Uh, Mauli ko is 7. 7 p.m. Yeah, so, and, the food is already uh, there, right? <laughs> So, but, but I, you, when your day off, Sunday, we'll Sunday. Go, so go to church are you, and then yeah, you do the home chores. Oh. So what kind of home chores do you're doing, like? And washing. Washing. Uh, <laughs> hand washing. Oh, hand washing. Yeah, yeah. Then. Then help them. Kung unsa ilang uh, trabaho. Help them. What is their uh, doing? Like work uh, about the house. Actually, I have work also in at home. At home. What kind of work? Lidar. Is that? Huh? Lidar. Remote as well. Remove the remotas. Remotas? Oh, oh. Isa na siya? Ang swill do anas every week. Every week? Oh, every so, week. Sa computer lang. Compu oh, computer. Lidar. Lidar. Mm -hmm. Alright, I don't know that. <laughs> I've not been working in the. I'm always um, facing my computer, but I don't know that kind of job. Try That's to great. It, yeah. That's great. Alright, so since you're doing the home chairs at home, so. Um, have you been dated? Dated? Dated, uh, like, have you been trying, tried dating with someone, with a guy? Yeah. Yes? How many times? I have ex-boyfriend. How many ex-boyfriends do you have? Two? Mm -hmm. So... One is 11 months and then 11 the second months. is two years. I two years ago? Wow, <laughs> that's that's long time ago. Alright. So, what is dating like for you? For you, what is dating? here in the Philippines because our viewers are curious what is dating like here in the Philippines. What's my dating para sa imuha like? Because I know that um, Filipinas were not date to sleep with. Like, we're not dating a person that um, dating like after that you will sleep with him. No. 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 So what is dating like for you? Like, kuan, uh, Knowing each other, uh, getting to know each oh, other. To know that's each the other. that's the important thing. Yeah. So what is the what the, what if a one guy will gonna say or let's say yeah one guy will gonna say um, let's have a dinner date tonight or what do you like for your first date? What do you like for the first date? He will gonna ask you um, let's gonna have our first date. What do you like for your first? Wala, kuan ra kung kuan um, say kaya. What is the man can offer? Mm -hmm. Like go if if he can afford uh, simple, going, uh, simple simple date. simple date. You want a simple date. All right. So if there is a one foreigner message you, would you interested to talk to him? Depends sa it depends. Oh, uh, depends sa it depends how he approaches you. Mm -hmm. Depende right. po sa iyang uh, rason kung ano nga. Uh, ah, there's mm -hmm. there should be a reason why you guys dated dating a Filipina. Oh. So there should Siyempre. be a reason why she will he will gonna date mm -hmm. you. Oh, that's great. So, what you can offer to a man? Uh, let's say he is deserving. So what you can offer to him? Tinud ano yung love? A true love. Oh wow, that's, <laughs> that's so sweet. A true love. If she, if he's uh, deserving of mm -hmm. my love, then why not? You can offer. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, I love that answer. So, have you been dating a foreigner? No? Mm. No? All, all of them are Filipinos. Uh, chatting? Yeah, before. Before, only but... chat, but not boyfriend. Mm. Chatting only. So, have you been tried dating up? <laughs> yes! yes. <laughs> How many dating apps did you? have you been tried? Um, wait lang. <laughs> just for fun? Like how many um, apps? Si Ate, cause we kuan. Your Ate, your sister, Mag older. Si yun nga, foreigner. <laughs> ah, your older sister. I'm um, telling One you time. that 
um, choose a foreigner boyfriend mm. than a Filipino. All right, that's great. Your your older sister pushing you, but you know what? You're pretty, and it is possible for you to to can have a foreigner boyfriend. <laughs> All right, that's great. So it's do you have a communicate. Facebook account? Yeah. Why? The or for, pardon again. You said it's hard to communicate with a foreigner. Why? <laughs> English. <laughs> English. <laughs> no, you can. But but you know what? For me, I don't. Before, I just only speak a little English. Mm-hmm. Even I'm in high school. Even I'm in like senior high. A little bit English only. I can speak straight English because I'm scared. I don't have confidence to speak uh, to speak English. But when you started talking with English people, mm. now you will develop it and you will adopt it. Then you will used to it. Oh my God! So, I hope so. Yeah, no, you will. <laughs> Since you will develop it and you will adopt it, then you will used to it. Oh my God! So, I hope so. Yeah, no, you will. <laughs> Since you're working in the IT, so um, mostly you're you will gonna use English, English language or communication. Oh, your sister is so sweet. <laughs> All right. So, um, what is your purpose of your Facebook account? To communicate other people, and then it is always used by my work. Used for your work. Oh. Because it's like IT, and sometimes we use it for school, mm-hmm. school purposes. Because we have GC or group chat. Yeah. <laughs> sometimes we receive so many messages in the day, but it's all group chats. Yeah. <laughs> I experience well, that be. kind of thing. That oh my god, it's group chats. <laughs> only message, <laughs> only message I receive today. So, when you go um, in the future, when you have, what if you will marry a foreigner? So would you? stay as a housewife or a full-time mom to your kids or um, you will go you will gonna get a job if you can if you can if you can afford like something and then if you want uh, to contribute uh-uh. then you will help them so what if he is capable to support for the family <laughs> what do you think are you want to still get a job or stay as a full-time mom you don't know yet yeah you don't know yet but what do you think in the future maybe, do you want to be a full-time mom or maybe if you want to uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because you know what it's a great opportunity also to become a full-time mom me i would like to become a full-time mom in the future i want to focus my kids and i want them to have a better future because you know if the mom was is not there for their kids um like the attitude and the way they live is different so it should be the light of the house is in there so the ilaw ng tahan yeah and the haligi or the foundation of the house is the father so what if there's something happened like a broken family would you like to be would you like to um experience that kind of thing a broken family no no if there is something like hardship in your relationship, would you still stay? You already got married, and would you still stay? You have a kids already, like two kids. Let's say example. Maybe it depends on the problem. It that, depends on the problem, uh, but would you still stay for the kids? Yes. Uh, that's a heart of a. That ha- that's a heart of a Filipino. Filipino. Um, is um is it your parents or your mom experienced that that no. she stayed for the kids? Have you been um like um your parents? Have you saw your parents like they are fighting? Yeah, before before. Um, I grew up with like so many, so many fighting in the house, oh. but it's not normal here, right? <laughs> because my parents used to do that also, and. Since my mom is brave, she don't like to she don't like to sip, she don't like a broken family. So she stayed in the house just for us. She stayed in the family just for us to have a bit of picture. All right. But so now it's, it's what? happy. It's happy. Yeah, oh, we have the same life. <laughs> All right. So that's great because even in the wedding, right? For better and for worse. So if you have uh, if you will going to marry someone in the future and if he is a foreigner or a Filipino, we don't um, Filipino or foreigner, would you like to? Uh, what is your wedding prefer? Like, 
a church wedding or a court wedding? Church wedding. Church wedding. So what is your religion? Born again. Born again. <laughs> yeah. That's Christian. So right. So thank you so much, Miss Jana Me and uh, high five again. <laughs> so it is my privilege and uh, opportunity to talk to you. That now I know I I have like more information about what does Filipino wants, especially in dating. And our viewers will gonna know <laughs> about that. You know they are curious because Western and Filipino dating is different. Mm -hmm. So as Filipinas, for the first date we want like something like getting to know each other first yeah. we don't like to date and to sleep with we date to marry ah! yeah so thank you so much miss jenna so that's all everyone and thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to click the like subscribe and click the notification bell for more videos if you want to help my channel it's better to watch the ads click the likes likes is very important and click the subscription button bye